I wanted to show you how to uh, copy and paste special from Excel to Excel and also from a Word document to Excel. So on your Excel sheet, if you go to the very end of the Excel sheet of all the sheets down here where my mouse is, you'll see a little arrow that goes uh, with a little uh, line after it. If you click on that, that will take you to the last Excel sheet and the last Excel sheet is data and on that sheet you'll find data from the textbook for chapters 2 through um, 10 at least and the way you can uh, uh, save yourself from having to type this data in is highlight the data and then right mouse click and copy then go to the sheet and I'll use these arrows to go to the sheet that I want to go to and I'll use this button right here, this arrow with a line to the left to go to uh, the very beginning and I'm going to go to the raw data sheet and now in this area right here I'm going to click and right mouse click, right mouse click and choose paste special. Don't choose paste but choose paste special and now when you choose paste special you'll get a lot of choices and the choice that uh, is the best to use is this one right here, values. So choose values and then say OK and that puts the values in and now you have all your information in this table and if you wanted to break this up into so many groups, let's say five groups and, and the desk, there's no uh, significant numbers to the right of the decimal point so there'd be zero numbers to the right of the decimal point and you have your uh, groups made up and to copy this data here uh, over to a group data sheet you just cop, uh, click this button right there and that copied that data, that data from the raw data sheet over. Now let's say that this button didn't work. If this button didn't work for you because of macro security level or whatever the reason then what you can do is highlight this data like we did before, right mouse click, copy, go to the sheet that you want to put it in, let's say group data, click right here right mouse click and make sure you choose paste special. If you choose paste this is what will happen. That and you don't want that because what it did is it took the formulas over and we don't want the formulas all we want is the value so if that ever happens undo that and right mouse click and choose paste special as values and say OK. Now occasionally on a quiz or a test you will have a Word document that has a link and so let me go ahead and uh, I have a quiz question from section uh, chapter 2 and you could type in all this data but eventually there might be so much data that you don't want to type it all in. So you can click on the link and when you click on that link it gives you a chance to open up a Word document and uh, you have to have Word on your computer for this to open. Now just highlight the data, click and drag over the data. If there's any titles don't highlight that. Then right mouse click and choose copy then go to the Excel sheet where you wanted to put this data in and let's say you wanted to put this into the uh, raw data sheet then I would right mouse click right here and paste special don't do paste if you do paste you'll lock up the, uh, the sheet let me just show you that again if I do paste right mouse click and do paste it yeah it calculates it but now if I try to change this number I get another problem it says the cells are locked so you undo that and right mouse click and choose paste special as text so from Word to Excel you paste special as text from Excel to Excel you paste special as values and so we have that data in there if there was any extra values in here that uh, were from a previous problem I would delete it and now I have every bit of information for that data. So hopefully that shows you uh, how to copy uh, data from the data sheet, which is the last sheet, and paste special as values into anywhere in Excel, and also how to uh, copy things from a Word document and paste special as text into an Excel uh, sheet. Okay, well, that'll do it. Thanks a lot.